so the most important thing you want to do is your linchpin questions have got to differentiate you from your competitors never compare you to your competitors the other thing the next thing so, so let's rewind so the first thing you've got to do is you've got to ask what is my unique selling proposition how do I build questions around my unique selling proposition and the next thing you want to ask is how do I help people to see things from my perspective in other words what is your perspective well my perspective is, is these are my unique selling propositions now what I want to ask you is how will these specific features serve you get an understanding of are those important to that customer maybe they are maybe they aren't you see what you might believe is unique and special about your product might not be something important to your customer and the only way to find that out is by digging by asking those open-ended meaningful questions because ultimately why are we asking questions well we're asking questions because we want to unlock sales we want to unlock sales but how do we unlock sales? Well, we can only unlock sales when we figure out how to align what we do with what the customer needs. So this is all about digging and digging and digging deeper until we fully uncovered what matters to our customers. Because prospects will convince themselves that the value that you offer is aligned with what they need when we can funnel it down and figure out exactly which parts of our value proposition matters to that specific customer. Remember, linchpin questions are all about engagement. In fact, all questions or all open-ended questions are about encouraging customer engagement. So, how do we encourage customer engagement? Well, we ask open-ended questions. So, your linchpin questions need to start with what, which, why, how? And that is going to help you to dig deeper to uncover what matters to your customers.